Hey guys, what's up? It's Greggles from the Greggles and Dan Show. Today I'm going to show you how to install the PS4 Remote Play app. I had a few people out there asking me how to install this app, so I'll walk you through all the ways that you need to do and what you need to do. So the first thing you want to do is turn on your PlayStation 4 and go into the settings. Next you want to go down to the uh, Remote Play Connection settings. And you want to enable enable you want to <laughs> check enable remote play as you can see right here and you just want to step back and then next step we're going to do is we're going to go on the uh, nvidia shield tv on your nvidia shield tv you want to go down to settings go all the way over to uh, security and restrictions and you want to turn unknown sources on hit the home button and now there's two ways to get this next app on if you have a browser on it here you can download it from the browser otherwise you want to put this file onto a USB drive or a, or a SD card and then put that into the Nvidia Shield TV but ultimately I'll do it from the browser so I'm going to go to um, Oops. I'm going to go to Chrome. I wanted to keep it in the wrong button. I'm going to load up Chrome. And I'm going to type PS4 Remote Play. APK hit go it's gonna search for it you want to go to the XDA developers one right here so you go here and there should be a download link in here So dual shock install instructions. Where is it? Downloads. So we want we'll do this one. Remote play portable 1.3.2 invisible touch buttons. So we want this one. We don't need the invisible touch button. So we'll click this. It's gonna say you want to save it. We're gonna hit OK. And that's gonna go to our downloads folder. So we will hit our home button, go open up ES File Explorer, which you can download from the Google Play Store within the NVIDIA Shield. Go into our downloads folder from here. Here it is, Remote Play 1.3.2. Click on it, hit install. Hit done. All right, then I'm gonna load up side load launcher. Go to PS4 Remote Play. Hit next. Now, if this is your first time, it's gonna ask you, which is not my first time, it's gonna ask you to log in with your uh, PlayStation st Store uh, username and password. So you log in with that, it's gonna bring you to a website, and then once you log in, it'll bring you here, and this is where you can control the PS4. So that's how you install it, and then obviously you can play any game that you have on here. I don't have that many games for PS4, I'm more of an Xbox One guy, but like I said, you can play. Picks, picks the cat, I guess, let's try that real quick. Yeah, if you guys have questions about this, uh, feel free to ask in the comments. Uh, it's fairly easy to set up though, especially, and you can do this on any phone that's an Android phone or tablet. Um, and so, play, collect eggs, drop ducklings. And the other thing is you can plug in your PS4 remote 
into the USB port of the NVIDIA Shield if you don't want to have to sync it up Bluetooth. Because when you sync it up Bluetooth, it messes up with the, the, um, the registration of the PS4. It's better to just plug it right in. So, I don't know how you play this game, but whatever. So this is Fix the Cat. Can I turn? There you go. Combo. There you go. That's how you play Fix the Cat. Thanks for watching, guys. If you have any questions or comments, let us know. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. We'll check you guys next time.